Okay, I'm making a simple traffic bot and I finally finished it. I had a lot of errors with this indented block error. Palava, didn't like it. Kept trying different things, but um, you've got to get the code in the, all in the same position. That's the block indentation. So I'm using 4i in range. In here I put 10, which is 10 times round. So you put your code in, whatever it is, or it's a traffic bot or whatever you want repeated. I'm repeating this, and I put it in 10 times. My code is web browser open to the site. I've got import web browser there. Then sleep for 15 seconds using time. I've got import time. That'll be do nothing on the site. Then move using pi to GUI. Move to those coordinates. That's move the cursor. So I've imported pi to GUI. You have to download that. Those are my other videos. Time's already on it. And web browser's already on it. That's Python. Okay. Then there's a scroll using Py to GUI. And then move again to coordinates, which are in top right. That's to click away. Then go through it all again with another site. So you're basically opening a website, doing a bit, clicking away, opening another website, clicking away. Now with this four iron range, that should work 10 times. I'm just going to put in here just to show it works, I'm going to put in two, twice, twice round. This is my experiment. If it works, I can make this code longer. I can add more sites and we'll add another two, which will be four websites. There could be more. There could be more eventually. But for the time being, there'll be four. So that'll make it go around twice. Once I've done the code, when I've done it all, I'll probably put in a hundred. Make it go around for a few hours, a traffic bot working as I work on other sites. So let's run this anyway, see if it works. Run in the module. Got to save it, because there's a few changes. So that's working, just run in the module. So website opening, web browser opening to first site. Should be a 15 second delay, letting everything load. That's the adverts and whatnot. And then the cursor should move and it's just started moving it, moving to somewhere around sort of central position. And that's using the Pi Auto GUI import, which I downloaded and showed in the other videos. Right, there was a scroll. I'm gonna make that longer. I wanna make it longer to kind of push pop unders for, to work. All right, it's just clicked away. Now a few seconds and the second site should work. That's an opening screen, that's, that's loading to the landing page. <coughs> it's loaded. Cursor is now moving to a central position using Pi to GUI again. That's a pop up that's just come up. Now the cursor is moving back the way it came, back to close, close tab. And that would be the end of that line of code. So hopefully it should go around for a second go. That's at the bottom there. So let's see. For Iron Rage 2, I'm hoping it opens and it's opening again to the first site. So this works. And a scroll. <clears throat> that was a thousand scroll. I'd have to make, I'm going to experiment with that. 
make it two or even three thousand. I want a movement on site to create the pop unders to move. Now it's opening the second site again, which should be the final site. Okay, moving towards click away. And that should be it. And that's that at the bottom. Click, Pyotr GUI click, which is that position right at the top, top right. So it works. Four I in range two, made it go around twice. So if I put in 10, it's going to be 10 times, if I put 100, 100, 1000. So that should work for me. I just have to keep changing the VPN to USA and Canada, Australia. But you could probably put that in as well, a click position to where your VPN is. And that's it. So that's that four iron range. Just make sure after that line, on this second line, there is an indented block of four spaces for each code, and then it will work. 